My name is Chelsea and I'm a reader's advisor from the Mount Prospect Public Library. Since some of us might be seeking a little armchair adrenaline lately, I thought I could share some vicarious thrills. Our first book is The Perilous Adventures of the Cowboy King, a novel of Teddy Roosevelt and His Times by Jerome Cherlin. It's a fun romp based on Roosevelt's upbringing and everything in between him becoming president. There are many unforgettable characters from his unique family to the Rough Riders and Teddy's dearest friend, Josephine, the mountain lion. This book contains laughs, adventure, crime fighting, and even a charge up the San Juan Hill. Next up is Daniel Silva's Gabriel Alon series. Alon is a master art restorer and legendary spy. He travels the world setting art and criminals straight. There's often politics at the highest levels and vengeance involved. Additionally, this is a series that can be read out of order and you won't miss a beat. The first in the series is The Kill Artist. The Heist is the 14th in the series and it sounds like a good way to escape right now. It involves a missing Caravaggio painting, a hunt through Europe, and a confrontation with one of the world's most brutal dictators. Next up, Alpha by Greg Rucka introduces us to Jonathan Bell, a special operative who's come back to the States. He takes out a high level security job at a theme park in California called Wilsonville. Insert a Russian sleeper agent who gets a summer job there and chaos ensues. From toxin being released, a dirty bomb and hostages quickly enter into the situation. And unfortunately, one of these hostages is Belle's 16 year old daughter who happens to be deaf. A truly heart pounding book. Last but not least, The Lost City of the Monkey God, a true story by Douglas Preston. It contains Preston's experiences being part of an expedition to find a lost city in the mountains of Honduras. The myth behind the city is that a number of catastrophes occurred there, so the people had to drop everything and leave, and since then it's been considered cursed and death will come to anyone who ventures in. Follows their harrowing journey to reach the city, and they do, they find it, and plenty of other fascinating finds, but there is some truth to the lost city being notoriously life-threatening. This book, as well as all the other books that I mentioned, are available on either Hoopla or Overdrive. And if any of these titles don't get your adrenaline pumping, email us for reading suggestions at readers at mppl.org. We welcome you to share titles as well that you've enjoyed in our No Commitment Virtual Book Club group on Goodreads. And as always, happy reading.